Today we're going to be talking about our tomato trellis system that might end up in failure. Hold up just a minute, been looking for some help just to find myself. Yeah, been losing my focus like a thousand times before. Can't take this anymore. Cause I've been looking for something to change thoughts into motion Been waiting way too long oh, oh. What is up everyone? So today we're going to be talking about our tomato trellis system. I got this system from Josh Satin over at Josh Satin Farming. Uh, go check. I'll link to his channel down below in the video that we saw. Um, I did do some things a little bit different that might end up in failure. But if you're curious to see how that turns out at the end of the season, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Uh, it's a really simple system though. Here is we got actually some five foot T post. Um, and we have them spaced out. We have three per row because our rows are about uh, 10 feet. JK, not 10 feet. That is way longer than 10 feet. I don't know, maybe 12 feet. 12, 15 feet. I guess he's close to 20. Closer to 20 feet. Closer to 20 feet. So we have one in the middle. Um, I chose to go with PVC pipe instead of the electrical content like he recommends in his video. And the main reason I did that was because it was a little bit cheaper. Um, this was, I think, three, like three fifty, a uh, pole, versus like eight or nine dollars for the electrical content. Um, where that might bite us is the fact, as you can see here behind me, that they are bowing. Um, I figured I had a small enough gauge that I wouldn't flex too much, but um, it is. We went with the, I think it's about the one inch PVC pipe, and then we just have little T toppers on top of the post um, and just simple uh, garden twine down to a shish kebab skewer. Um, they were $3 for a giant pack, so it was pretty cheap. Um, just tied to the bottom of that, stuck it in the bottom. Uh, and the idea is that the tomato plants grow up. The other thing that we also did that is a little bit different, um, we went with the five foot T post. Um, if you watch his video, you'll notice that he's definitely using probably the seven foot T post. Uh, I think this was probably a better choice. Once again, went with these ones because they were half the price. So maybe a little bit on the shorter side, but um, you know, we're gonna see how it turns out. Um, if it doesn't turn out good, obviously we know not to come back to this system next year or, you know, maybe do it the right way. <laughs> 